Well, Canada, here is your summer forecast, and we'll go coast to coast to coast and pick out the most important aspects of this forecast. Yeah, it's the season of funnel clouds and tornadoes. Canada features over 60 tornadoes every single spring, summer, and fall. And this is our official Weather Network summer forecast in the temperature department, and we'll start in eastern Canada. Your eyes are probably drawn to that weakness. When we check out the analog years, some of them are a little bit chillier when it comes to putting a little bit of troughing activity around Hudson Bay. We're fairly confident painting Atlantic Canada in above normal, slightly, mind you. And there's that weakness. But keep in mind, a normal summer is still quite hot and at times muggy. If we see these drought conditions continue, we can really overachieve in the temperature department. In terms of precipitation, the Bermuda High wants to pump moisture into Atlantic Canada. And there is the ring of fire. I'll get to that in a second. There's this swath of precipitation across central and northern sections of the prairies. But what causes this? A very resilient high pressure system in the western U.S., we could coin this the ring of fire, and we often see bursts of convection really pivoting around this feature. And in this type of environment, you can get severe weather, thunderstorms, dangerous tornadoes as well. Uh, that's absolutely beautiful, but downright terrifying. In terms of Western Canada, our temperatures... That ridge bubbling up from the U.S. above normal through much of Alberta, British Columbia, Saskatchewan. We'll watch the cooling trend towards parts of the Hudson Bay in northern Canada. Yeah, Canada, these are some of your highlights for the summer. But let's focus in on what matters. An active hurricane season will be on guard for Atlantic Canada. And your most important things to know, Ontario... We got some precipitation the end of May. We still have drought concerns, a worsening drought across the prairies. And of course, in the west and the north, wildfires and smoke. We're keeping tabs on that.